We made it to the weekend, the last weekend of October. And how about this weather cooking up to be a terrific weekend? There's a lot of events to look forward to centered around Halloween. Here's a few things I have on my radar. No baseball here, but this trick-or-treat event sure to be a home run. 13th annual baseball Halloween at Warner Park. Happening tonight from 5 to 8 with plenty of candy and activity stations on hand, along with a movie screening on the big board. The event is free, but you're encouraged to bring non-perishable food items like canned goods that will be donated to Food Bank for the Heartland. The Nebraska Humane Society getting into the Halloween spirit, hosting its inaugural Halloween bash. Drunk or treating, games, pumpkin painting, a creepy critter room, just some of the entertainment planned. This is a people only event, so pets stay home. It runs from 6 to 9.30 tonight. This event also not free, but all the money goes toward helping homeless animals in need. Another fundraiser for NHS happening at Dittmar's and Council Bluffs on Sunday. This one you want to bring the dogs for the Doggy Days of Fall costume contest. It's $10 to enter your furry friend. Again, proceeds going to NHS. It runs noon to 4, but the awards for best dog costume will be given around 145. Lots of fun to be had at the riverfront for its fall y'all at Heartland of America Park. It runs from 4 to 8.30 Saturday with trick-or-treat stations, games, a mobile petting zoo, Halloween movie screening, and much more. Food and drink vendors on hand for this free family-friendly event as well. Another family-friendly opportunity downtown, all a weekend at the Durham Museum. Trick-or-treat goodie bags and plenty of activities and exhibits to look forward to. It runs 10 to 4 both Saturday and Sunday. Children 12 and under get in free. No Halloween fun with this one, though. The Big Red's opponent this week is pretty spooky. Nebraska at fourth-ranked Ohio State Saturday. Game kicks off at 11. You can catch it on Fox. Events I've told you about the last few weeks, like Ghouls and Glow at the Zoo, Trunk or Treat at Wildlife Safari Park, and Haunted Tree Rush at Fontenelle Forest, all back this weekend, too. Plus, for the adults, Omaha's official Halloween bar crawl downtown Saturday and the Old Market Witches Walk on Sunday.